Hey y'all, this is Cody with Swamp Dog Armory up here at the NRA convention. I'm over here at the Modern Gun School booth with Zeke Stout, my buddy over here. How's it going? I'm good, man. How are you? Doing good. So, here y'all got some new stuff coming out at the school. We do. We do. Uh, we are, we have an basic advanced course. We always had it. The advanced has all the hands-on, hands-on projects. Uh, and now we're adding an advanced to uh so basically what that is, is it's everything in advance. We're adding a field. So there's an AR-15 that we collaborate with that we fire. And then along with that, there's a lot more tools. We're adding over 1,600 tools. That's pretty big. Uh, so the, my thought process behind that is, is you know, the honor these are cars, right? Yeah. You go to become a computer. Most of those schools, once you graduate, you got a pallet of things that can place any dealer separate thing and be able to start working. Guns are for place colleges, and so we don't really have that. So we wanted to make sure we had a bunch of open tools that some of the things we're adding is a real avid uh, bench box. The one that goes 360, it's amazing. Nothing is support. I saw the Great American Apple Shop. We're adding their armorer's kit. Their armorer's kit is awesome. I have one of them. I didn't pick up the vice yet, but I saw that over at the gathering event yeah. not too long ago, and that's one thing I'm definitely... It's, they did some to. really, really cool stuff. Uh, and then we're adding a bench grinder. We're adding a buffer. Uh, uh, Dremel. Dremel set with a 60 or 55 piece Dremel set. Yeah. So we're cool. adting a lot of stuff, but we're still coming in very up to So it's still, for all that... And the advanced grocery stuff from an interim that's uh, that's that that there. that ain't a bad deal for uh, education. No, 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 no. And you you can start a new career with it. Start a little side hustle in your garage, becoming a gunsmith, maybe a grocery more. Yeah. The thing I tell people all the time is like, with gunsmith, you need a small gunsmith to show. If you can find that niche and get good at it, then the sky's the limit because gunsmithing is kind of a dying. And it really is. That's how I was just having this conversation yesterday about how a lot of the older fellas that have the knowledge and the skills that you can't get from a book yep. don't really want to pass that down right. to younger folks because they, they've already done pass some stuff down or whatever. And a lot the, the newer generation that would be filling that gap and getting that information isn't seeking it out. Right. Exactly. And I can count on in one hand how many good guns there are with the number of yeah. upgrades. And it's like that in most of the yeah, from Where we're at in South Mississippi, there's actually no local gunsmith. Yeah. Where we're at, for even the, the local uh, law enforcement has to drive between 45 minutes to an hour to get sure. their stuff worked on. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. So, I mean, it's, it's definitely clear that you can be very successful uh, if you have a chair. I mean, just, just like anything. You can go to Harvard Medical School and be the worst doctor that ever freaking existed. Yeah. So, yeah. it's it's what you do with the knowledge you get out of school and apply yourself to it and it's really make it a passion for yourself. Yeah. Awesome. Well, I appreciate you Absolutely, taking the time man. and Anytime. explaining the things. And yep. Y'all make sure y'all check it out. Modern Guns. Modern Guns. Yep, mgs.edu. <laughs>